An adjustment in the scoring. There was an error from Nakpan Rachazima. So it's 6-4 Al Arabi Sport Club. But a block by the Philippines there put, makes this a one-point game. One-point timing for JP Buga. Number one. Easy over for the Bisco Philippines. They get lucky. They get it back the same way. Attack in the middle by Bugawan is a point. That should be a sure point when you are given a chance for that's your opportunity to run your counter attack. Filipinos so far making the most out of the opportunities they're getting here in set number one, keeping it a close match. Now, three all set number two. Not a good first ball. Easy put away for JP Bugawan. Rebis sitting on a three point lead here in set number two. The dig. Uh, not good enough though. Finally, uh, Rebisco Philippines breaking that run of Al Arabi. And Omandal also has to acknowledge that he is being targeted at that service line. So if you know that the ball is coming for Al Arabi, Lidus. Now at seven. Finally, Rubisco Philippines with a kill. They will try to cut down that six point lead. Malayo pa naman, it's a race to 25, but they can't afford to add more free points. Arabi Sport Club. 17 10, set number three. Bugawan gets it through, and that's a point for Rubisco Philippines. Still fighting back now. It seems like they're just enjoying the game, celebrating every point. Tiken. Don't serve. That's going to be a chance. And the Philippines takes advantage. This is a good sign here for Rubisco Philippines. I mean, everyone just getting on the scoreboard. Bugawan here with that regalo. The lead here in set number one. Chance ball here for Bisco Philippines. Looking to tie things up. Quickly they go to the middle. And, uh, the gamble of Retamar to Bukawan at this point of the game. Quick attack there, and you can see the blocker couldn't even move. He's had to just... On top of it with a good serve. Finally getting up some points in the middle. Rebisco Philippines is at set point. And that's what you want from your middle blocker so to get into the scoreboard. One of the few times Rebisco has utilized their middle. And the Philippines will push forward once again, up by one at 4-3. Bukawan getting set more. And they're gonna need that. Diamond Food expecting only sets from... Finisutai here, together with Carmela Tunay. And we've got a good one on our hands. From the back row. Better check there for... The blockers of the Bisco Philippines. Going to the pin. And that's not going to work there for Thailand. Again, talking about the touches, they're slowly progressing into, you know, the kill blocks. Kanina, um, the Tayo recovered by Thailand. But this time around, you see the block. Once. Pinasok na lang. Ooh. And the Philippines will make them pay. Bugawan just making noise right in time for them to take the lead here in the third set. Gotta love that acknowledgement from Jesse Lopez. So usually, mga Quakers na yan, kung san lang sa gitna. Walang katakot takot. Gotta come right back. Not gonna work there for Kisada. And look at that single block by Bugawan. Impressive timing. And he's done it against the taller 
Quisada. He knows where he was going and let's take a look at this block of the set. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.